Hello everyone, can you solve this problem not using a calculator? Pay attention first to these numbers, 11, 22, 33 and 44. They are all multiple of 11. So instead of 22 to the power of 3, let's write it as 2 times 11 to the power of 3. And that, we know, is equal to 2 to the power of 3 times 11 to the power of 3. So, let's rewrite the numerator as 11 to the power of 3 plus 2 to the power of 3 times 11 to the power of 3, which is this result here, plus, instead of that, 3 to the power of 3 times 11 to the power of 3, and instead of that, plus 4 to the power of 3 times 11 to the power of 3. In the denominator, let's write 11 times 2 times 11 times 3 times 11 times 4 times 11. Okay, now, in the numerator, let's factorize 11 to the power 3, which multiplies 1 plus 2 to the power of 3 plus 3 to the power of 3 plus 4 to the power of 3. In the denominator, we get 11 4 times, so 11 to the power of 4 times 2 times 3 times 4. Now we will cancel out 11 to the power 3 in the numerator and in the denominator, remaining 11 times 2 times 3 times 4. Okay, so this term in brackets is 1 plus 2 to the power of 3 is 8. 3 squared is 9. 9 times 3 is 27. 4 squared is 16. Multiplied by 4 is 64. 1 plus 8 is 9. Plus 27 is 36. Plus 64 is 100 over the same denominator. Let's try to simplify the numerator. So, 100 over 2 is 50. If you divide by 2 again, you get 25. So, let's do that. 100 over 4 is 25. In the denominator, we get 2 times 3, which is 6, times 11, 66. And this is the answer for the problem. 25 over 66.